I just noticed something through life, right? This through life. I never experienced like um I guess cause every, all the people are narcissists and they, they hated me and everybody hated me and everybody in my inner circle or whatever, they really hated my fucking guts. And I'm, 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 at least I'm coming out to say it. I'm getting off my chest this morning. I know you motherfuckers don't like me because I ain't never got, I ain't got no Valentine's Day cards. You know, I was looking at the Christmas cards. And I said, damn, my landlord even got me a Christmas card before. And um, I ain't got no Valentine's Day cards from no motherfucking body. Like, not from one motherfucking person. Like, you motherfuckers have been pure fucking evil against me. Like, I'm starting to really think there's some real rogue ass shit going on on this planet because I'm probably the only motherfucker on this planet. And and what, what make it so what make it so bad is I know I ain't no ugly motherfucker or nothing. I ain't no ugly motherfucker or nothing. But you motherfuckers ain't never got me at least one Valentine's Day card. Not one. Not one. I I ain't never even experienced the um you know the the, the real moment on Valentine's Day. I can't even remember. It might have been a moment in 2013 or something. You know what it is? I know what it is. When you motherfuckers see virtuous people together, when y'all see virtuous couples together, especially you fucking crackheads and dope fiends, that's why I'm confronting y'all bitch ass this morning. You fucking crackheads and dope fiends. Y'all like to break people up. That's what y'all do. Y'all like to break up happy fucking homes. That's what the fuck y'all do, man. And I noticed that over the years, y'all never let me experience true love. Y'all never let me experience this shit, man. Y'all always fucking hating me. And that and, and, and that's and that's probably why I feel some of the anger that I feel in my heart. Because you motherfuckers hate me. And I know you motherfuckers don't like me, man. I got a black and white screen on. I don't give a fuck. I know you motherfuckers don't like me. That's what this about. Especially the females. The females always dog me out. I've always been dogged out by every fucking female I come in contact with. And they just like dogging you out. And they like talking to you any kind of way. Even when you're trying to be nice and trying to be cordial or funny with them or anything. It just don't. Nothing works for me. Nothing works for me. That's what I'm trying to see if, if some real rogue shit going on with you motherfuckers. That's, that's what I'm trying to find out. Why you motherfuckers hate me so much? I know in the Bible, it said that if you the most hated, that means you blessed. But you motherfuckers is like really throwing this shit in my face. You know what I mean? Y'all throwing this shit in my face every motherfucking day. And, and it's like it's purposely being done by just a small group of people in the populace. Okay? Like, y'all, y'all do all type of shit to fuck with, fuck with my head. Psychological warfare. I know that y'all waged on me over the years. Because y'all trying to cover up this motherfucking planet. And cover up the fact that y'all worship the devil. Cause that's the angle that I'm getting. Cause why y'all wanna fuck with me? Why y'all wanna fuck with me so hard? Why y'all wanna deny me the opportunities to feel love and compassion and feel the same stuff that the humans feel on a daily basis? That's what makes me think you motherfuckers not half you motherfuckers not uh not human because y'all coming after me. Y'all coming after me and it look it look personal. I, I say, I say, I bet you I'm the only person that ain't got no fucking Valentine's Day cards. Nobody like none. Like no motherfucker, no no female ever. No, nah, it was one. It was one. But that was way back, fucking high school almost, man. That was way back in the days. Like, I can't even remember how long ago that was. That girl gave me that um that Valentine's Day card. Okay, I remember those little, those little Valentine's Day cards in school. Like I probably got one of those like once or twice or something. And you know, through the history of school, cause the problem was we always changed schools every fucking year. 
Like, it was, I had a bullshit childhood anyway because we changed schools every year. And then when we did change schools, it was nothing but fucking bullies and shit. When you go to the new school, it's a whole new set of bullies to deal with. And then as I got older, I just noticed that people just don't fucking like you. They don't like me. Like, y'all like all the ugly, dope fiend, crackhead motherfuckers, but y'all don't like me. <laughs> y'all like all the homeless, nasty, funky, smelly motherfuckers ain't washed up in like probably two or three weeks. Y'all like them type of dudes, I guess, man. I don't know, man. That's what I'm saying. It's got to be some rogue shit going on. It's got to be some rogue shit going on. But half, you know, motherfuckers don't even care about hygiene anyway. Hygiene is a, is the lowest priority. <laughs> you know, so motherfuckers can care less if they got a little bit of hygiene issues to deal with. But you motherfuckers have always never really cared about me overall. I know who gives a fuck about me. My creator in heaven cares about me. But I know you motherfuckers on this planet have been full of shit. And y'all never gave a fuck about me. Period. Or I can at least have a uh, a Valentine's Day card or some proof that somebody cared. That Valentine's Day card probably from like damn near 25 years ago. I probably time traveled and lost that damn thing somewhere. It's been so long ago. And that was from the 90s. That that damn thing when was when um yeah when the, the R Kelly's first CD came out or some shit. Old ass shit, man. Like. Motherfuckers never, never really gave a fuck about me, dog. That's just the overall aspect of what I see, and like, it just, it hurt. But that's why I'm coming, coming grips with it on on social media, and I'm just gonna uh, get over it because I know, I know you motherfuckers don't don't like me overall, and I know you motherfuckers like all the crackheads and dope fiends. And all other, you know, whatever, whatever type of people that y'all like. Y'all don't like people like me. That's what it is. And, and I know what it is mostly because I'm not a crackhead or a dope fiend. Because those are the people that attract most of the fucking females is the crackheads and dope fiends. So, like I said, I'm just, I'm just going to let it go, man. I'm just going to let it go because I know, I, I feel like you motherfuckers are just fucking with me. That's all it is, and if I got if I got if I got to come forward on TV and just say why'd you make that type of video because you motherfuckers was fucking with me, uh, what I'm gonna say is I'm gonna tell the truth. If I was a crackhead or a fucking dope fiend, maybe your motherfuckers wouldn't treat treat me like that because I know y'all don't treat the crackheads. Y'all treat the crackheads and dope fiends with way more respect, and y'all give them way more attention than y'all give the people that's not that's not on the crackhead shit. You know, I'm just telling the truth. I'm just keeping it 100. All the crackhead, dope dudes get all the fucking attention. They could be in and out of jail, putting shit up their nose all the motherfucking time. They get all the motherfucking attention. Dudes like me, we don't get the attention, dude. We don't get the attention and the care and the trust that we that we deserve and that we need because. We not crackheads and dope fiends, so I guess that's just the way it's gonna be. I guess I guess ain't nobody gonna like me because I'm not a crackhead or a motherfucking dope fiend. That just that just how it's gonna be, man. I just gotta let it go.